Makes a major departure from that uh, benign role. Plays a heavy, and and they tell they tell me with great conviction. Here's John Stamos, everybody. <laughs> It's over for me. You I see, got Cy Sperling's home phone number if you want to give him a call. <laughs> you I, look good. Any day now. You both do. You're both sex symbols. What the heck? You see, I shouldn't wear a tie anymore. You don't need a tie. I, wear your football tie and that's it. That's it. That's all I'm going to wear from now on. Hey, how you doing? Great. Okay. How you doing? See, but didn't you come on about... <laughs> didn't you come on about a year ago? You had played this guy traveling with another guy and you were a heavy duty guy in that too? You yes, were like a yes. drug guy and yes. all of that? Yes. So this isn't the first time you've been playing a, a nasty guy? No. <laughs> and, and what about Black? Yeah. Blackie yeah. was sweet. He, but, but he, Blackie was lovable. Yeah, but he had an edge to him, too, I think. He had yeah. sort of an undercurrent there, too. No, but, but Blackie wasn't evil. See, the casting guys are beginning to look at you out there and say, wait a minute, wait a minute, it's not Mr. Goody Two-Shoes anymore. Right. There's, uh, there's a I darker love show. Song. I love this show because you don't have to talk. That's just right. Come on. <laughs> And, and, and Why don't you just have a picture of me and just then go? <laughs> Good idea. You wouldn't have to fly in. Yeah, but that's a great idea. <laughs> Who Who needs these people? On air Put travel. the picture here, and Kathy Lee and I will talk to the picture <laughs> and to each other if you there don't you mind. That's a great idea. You don't need anybody. It's been great having John. Yeah, John. Thank, thank you. So thank, much. You. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Now we just got back from Disney World, and I about that, huh? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you jealous about that? No, it's, did you guys have a good time down there? Oh, we yeah, did. A but you're a big uh, fan. Grew up near Disneyland, yeah. Mm -hmm. Took all the dates there. You know, that was okay. Is that a great date place? It really loosens everybody up, doesn't it? <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. Soften her up with Mickey yeah. Mouse and then move in for the kill. <laughs> well, you get scared on those rides. Yeah. You yeah. Sort of you gotta have those are the old days, no. Have you been at Disney World, though? Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's great fun. Yeah. Yeah. Disneyland is great, but I mean, you could put Disneyland in the parking lot, right. and I'm not kidding now, of, um, what is the kids... Park? Small World or uh, Magic Kingdom? Magic Kingdom. You can put Disneyland in the parking lot of... Yeah. How big Disney, Disney World is. Yeah. <laughs> what so else we, shot, we shot an episode of Full House down there. Oh, that's right, yeah. sure. Bob Saget was there. Right, yeah. yeah. The whole gang was there. Like Young Reed, Bob. Like, Reed's watched the show. Oh, yeah, I remember that one. That was a good one. <laughs> no, I'll tell you they why. Have your remember, pictures yeah. up. They no. have your pictures up down Timmy, there. Timmy, my guide. Who oh, yeah. Loved Timmy Bob and Jimmy. Saget. Yeah. Right. It's all Timmy talked about with Bob Saget. Yeah. Yeah. So, how are your dog? <laughs> I don't know what else to ask. What is this? Go. Oh. <laughs> the dogs are fine, Regis. How are yours? Yeah, I'm, I don't have any dogs. Yeah. I have two cats and they give me nothing. Absolutely right. nothing. <laughs> cats are so Cats make me sneeze. And oh, yeah? Yeah. yeah. yeah I'm very Eyes get red yeah, and all right, that. Yeah. But you had uh, a big German shepherd who didn't understand English or something. Yeah. He was really a German shepherd, right, you yeah. know? Where was he raised? Germany. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> now I have two. I have two German shepherds and then neither of them speak English and I'm... Well, yeah, it's tough on you. Yeah. And you're looking for a... And you're <laughs> tough on you. <laughs> yeah. And you're looking for a third. No, 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 I think two is enough. Two is enough. You can bring the cats over if you want to get rid of them. I mean, if you want to... Uh, <laughs> Boy, I'll <laughs> bet. If you are dirt to I'll them. I'll bet. So... So, so, you know what's thrown us off a little bit? What's that? The fact that right before you came on, we were told that they're going to change the name of your movie. Yes. So we can't really discuss your movie too much because the name we were told it's going to be is not going to be the name. No. And so, right. Let's decide on the title right Let's, now. What do you what, want to call it? Should we make a title? Yeah. What, what is the old the title? The Kathy Lee story? No, no, no. no, no. no. Well, well, really, no kidding, uh, no kidding around. What, what was the old title? The old title was um, uh, Sleep with Danger. I play a very uh, kind of... Sleep with Danger. Yes, right. Not a bad title. Not a bad title. Uh, yes. In other words, whoever is sleeping with you is sleeping with danger. If you will. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, how about... And what are you playing? Sleep with Stamos. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we want to get ratings. You know? <laughs> this is a very strange, different guy. I'm, he's kind of a, a complex, like a charming, charismatic kind of... Uh, kind of guy who falls in love with this gal. And uh, she try, when she finds out that he's not really what he is, he does whatever he can physically to keep her as part of the relationship. You know, because he's so obsessive. Really, yeah, exactly. Ah. Yeah, I, think it, I think he really thought of her as his mother. This is a true story. And didn't want to let her go. Instead of killing her, which he couldn't, he kind of ways in other places. 
and to keep her exactly, near him. Yeah. yeah. Sleep with danger, perfect title. Right. When we come back, we'll take a look at a clip from this movie in a second. Still ahead on live, Alex. Bunch and you know that thing with yeah. Tony Bennett and then Bon Jovi and all these guys are singing the uh, tribute to Elvis. Oh really? And you're yeah. hosting it? Yeah, we're doing an ABC special oh, and then great. a pay per view great. thing. Were you an Elvis fan? <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Yeah. Oh, oh. Is that down in, in Graceland? Yeah. Yeah. yeah sure. You you've been to Graceland? I'm I sure. have. Yeah. 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 You just feel his presence there, you know. Well, yeah. Charlie, I've never seen you so untalkative. What's uh, going on, baby? Yeah, I don't and know. You got, I, 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 you got a new, new girlfriend you no, don't want to talk is, about? No, everything is You're afraid fine. I'm going to bring up? What's going on? What's the no, no, Everything's great. I'm having a great time. I just, down to the just, couch. Just, we'll talk okay, to you. Come on. We <laughs> <laughs> so this is a true story, this, uh, this TV movie. Yeah. Or based on a true story. Right, yeah. Mm. It's pretty close. It was very close. I did some research before, and then I did a lot of research uh, afterwards. That was part of the... Uh, I mean, after I took the role, that was... Part of the challenge, I think. You know, I spent a lot of time with the court. You know, the, the transcripts and the court TV. So he did go to trial for so it. Yeah. This time, I went and talked to a psychologist, like why he would do these things and why he had these mm. killing feelings about him. He was musted by his father as well. Which is, you know, one more thing. Mm. Yeah. And then I went back the next day to the psychologist as the character and mm. had him interview me as this guy. Oh, that so that was that was really helpful. That's good. Yeah. Uh, was he a serial killer? Yes. Wow. How many? Six, they think, but I think he got convicted for three. Yeah, yeah. and probably more than that, you know, if the truth were known. Yeah. Cynthia Gibbs, uh, Gibb plays your wife in this, right? Right, yeah, she's yeah. very good. And she had to endure a lot, because it's really a lot about spousal abuse, you know, sure. and that was really a sure. large part Oh, she so was guy. married to this woman? Yeah, oh, yeah. he married her pretty fast. Yeah. All right, well, here's John Stamos as Nick the... I think this is the end of the movie where they're starting to pressure him, you know, and he's starting to lose his cool. Being pursued okay. by the police. Here we go. Come sit down. Try to relax. I made you a nice dinner. Can't relax. How can I relax when I'm being harassed like this? Cops crawling all over the place. You bastards think you can pressure me, huh? Huh? Well, my lawyer. Yeah, I'm sorry. Well, you want an injunction, huh? Want me to get an injunction? For oh, what? My job to keep the streets safe from scum like you. I don't know about you, but I'm tired of visiting morgues. Listen! Watson, that's police property. I need to speak with Cabrillo. You yeah. I'll take you. I'm sure. I've been waiting for this. I've been absolutely waiting for it. Right here. Pick me up. You gotta get rid of your damn cops. They're making them crazy. We want him off balance. Pretty boy. You're gonna blow it. I'm telling you, if you want me to do something here, you need to back off. Hey, let's just switch the decaf, huh? I'll take the decaf and shove it down your throat. We know what we're doing. I am telling you, if you want me to nail him, you're gonna have to give me some room. I yeah, I was by that point. To leave a character like that at the yeah, set. what's it, it like? Took me a long time. Yeah, I, I went on right on tour with the Beach Boys afterwards, so I was playing a little more violent than I <laughs> normally yeah. would. You know. Yeah. All right, we look forward to it. Whatever the name is, it's coming up on October 25th on CBS. Right back with Paulie and more stories about trouble. Tomorrow on Live from Blossom, Mayim Diallo.